Swimming in lane number one from Plymouth White Marsh Aquatics, Andrew Abruzzo. In lane number two from Longhorn Aquatics, Clark Smith. Lane number three, swimming unattached, Marwan Elkamash. In lane four, your top qualifier, swimming for the nation's capital swim club, Jack Conger. Lane five, swimming for Mission Viejo, Zane Grothy. Lane six from Baylor Swim Club, Trey Freeman. Lane seven, swimming unattached, Demetrios Demetrio. And in lane eight from High Performance, Center Victoria of Jeremy Bagshaw. This is the A final in the men's 200 freestyle. Top time in the world. This year's a 146.49. That's owned by Australia's Kyle Chalmers. Zane Grothy, who's swimming in lane number five. He's got the seventh fastest time in the world so far, 148.18. Pool record is a 146.36. Was set in 2011, one of the older records that we have here at the Macaulay Aquatic Center. Grothy, part of that bronze medal world championship 800 meter free relay. Conger though. The one with a big lead right now at the halfway mark. Conger part of that gold medal 800 free relay. In Rio, he's still in the lead, 119.62 with 50 meters remaining. Conger third at Olympic trials in 2016. Looking to set a best time, 145.77. Not going to do that, but he is going to go 146.96. Good for the third fastest time in the world thus far this year. West heading into 2020. We're still a couple of years away from that, but as you compete in this Pro Swim Series, are you feeling the pressure of getting ready for that big event two years from now? Yeah, I mean, it's all kind of, you know, it's a little bit of a process, but, you know, 2020 is the end goal, but 
You know, you just take it meat by meat and, uh, you know, focus on making the fan back team this year. You, you, you talk about meat by meat, Jack, but this meat right here, you're having uh, quite a performance. 100 fly last night, 51 flack. That was a great swim. And then following up over the solid 200 freestyle as well. Part of that game plan to come in here and swim fast? Yeah, absolutely. You know, we got a little bit of like a, like a weak taper. We piggybacked off the college guys for uh, Big 12s and leading NCAAs. So Eddie kind of wanted us to shave and uh, see what we could do and get as close as we can to our best times. Well, you certainly did. Great job. Thank you. Congratulations on the victory. And that's going to wrap up all of the action for this night. It Ladies and gentlemen, we have about six minutes left in our broadcast time, so we will not begin the next race. For another six minutes, we will resume competition with the women's 400 IM promptly at 8.30, which is about six minutes away. So hang tight. <laughs>